Hello guys, just a little video how I am replacing now transmission mount on my car. Here you can see I am under the car, the car is checked. Make sure to check the car very securely. Be safe. Here is the old transmission mount I have removed from my car. Uh, to be honest, it is very easy to remove. We have two 16 mm bolts and we have two 30 here is the 30 mm socket 30 mm bolts on the cross member and then you can remove this transmission mount now my friends i will compare it to the new one that i'm going to install on my car and see what are the main differences so my friends here are two transmission mounts for my W210. Here you can see that I marked F because uh, this is the front uh, part or side uh, which looks to the rear wheels of the car. Uh, here are both of them. To be honest, the new transmission mount is different. Here you can see, I mean the form and shape it is wider compared to the old one uh, new is better because old is 23 years old and it is worn and tired already but still genuine mercedes part but i'd better replace it with the new one i will reuse all the bolts and hardware because they are in good condition now I will try to mount this transmission mount on my car and share with you the main aspects which must be considered doing this job. So my friends, I have installed new AMG transmission mount. Here you can see the car is jacked up. I have put jack stands under the car, also used some heavy duty jack to support the engine. Here you can see that new transmission mount is installed on its place and the main difficulties here are to match the uh, bolts with the holes, I mean two holes on the transmission and two holes under the cross member. Uh, I simply put the little jack under the transmission oil pan, used some wood piece not to damage uh, the pan itself and then jacked up the transmission and it uh, allowed me to match the bolts uh, on the transmission uh, and then I was also able to play a little uh, and, uh, and finally I matched the uh, bottom 30 mm bolts with the cross member holes uh, and at least the transmission mount is installed here to be honest it is a little bit difficult if you are under the car but uh, I was lucky in this situation and uh, I have reached this result with first try or from first try and it is very good hope guys you enjoy this video to be honest I cranked the car and there are no vibrations uh, very very good operation and I like it if you have any uh, questions ask below thank you for watching and i will catch you in the next episodes goodbye my friends